so here is the other world that makes martial arts talent, Khabib Nurmagomedov, and there's so much made about his value as a corner man. Tonight, though, he is competing and has Bulas in his corner. Yeah, Coach Khabib is as undefeated as fighter Nurmagomedov compete again. This guy is the definition of pressure. He is trying to take you down, and he does not hide his intentions. He wants to get in your face, he wants to take you down, and he wants to drown you. This guy is a savage, he's a beast. Every word that describes that is Habib Nurmagomedov with a bull in his corner. Ready. Ready. Do it. Well, what a splash the UFC makes every time we come to the United Kingdom. If you want to see the UFC live in London, you better buy tickets within five minutes of them going on sale and you're going to be inside. You're going to be standing outside hoping to be inside the arena. All the way back to UFC 75, champion versus champion. Rampage versus Dan Henderson. The UFC has one fight that has blown the roof off the O2 arena. Yes, smart adjustment, yep. Drops down inside the now closed guard of his opponent. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Good work from the top here by Nermago Meadow. On oh, another punch on the ground gets through, may need some defense here. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Lands a quick jab. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Great diversity in his attack. Nice elbow to punch. And now a little separation between the two fighters. Shoots for a takedown here. Nearly got the fight to the ground, but once again, the takedown defense holds up. But he knows this. He knows that in order to finally get the fight to the ground, he has to be patient and he's going to have to be committed. If he thought that he would get every takedown he shot, he would not find the success that he intends to get. Straight right is there. Just over three minutes now to go in round one. Another takedown land. Marco Madoff's in half goal. Oh, right into Mount. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Gotta be careful here. Ooh, right into side control, DC. This is where you want to be now because you get to make your opponent decide. Oh, in good position to rip off the Kimura here. Ooh, that Kimura looks tight. Just stayed calm. He's able to withstand the fire. And now he finds himself out and safe. Now inside the first guard. And he's going to try to find ways to pass and move to a submission. Back and forth we go. Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's thrown. I mean, punches and punches. He's doing a great job. Another shot here. All right, late round action here in Khabib Nurmagomedov, as usual, having his way. Picture-perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Let him go. Time to let those hands go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, nice jab. 190 seconds to go round one. Real sneaky body kick. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. John, it may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Huge knee lands to the clinch. He closes the distance beautifully. He's got a single collar tie. Jab gets the attention of his opponent. 
Nice kick. These guys are going at him. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Takedown attempt late in the round and he gets it. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Oh, he passes the half guard now. And he's not posturing the land punches, so look for a submission attempt. He's gonna tight armbar here. What a tight armbar. but much better than getting his arm snapped in half from an arm bar. I want you to maintain dominance. All right, so the takedown's the big storyline in that previous round. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and got to be pretty discouraging to get grounded that many times in one round. Oh, it's so discouraging because all you want to do is let your offense go, but every time you're getting dragged to the floor constantly, you're starting to get fatigued. He's starting to wear on you. Let's see what type of effect it takes on his offensive approach as the next round starts. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, here we go with round two. Well, if you like wrestling and you like takedowns, I guess that's the round for you. He really had his way with his opponent there. Yeah, he was able to secure many takedowns, switching up the techniques, constantly changing the angle, never allowing his opponent to get a beat on what type of finish he was trying to go to. Oh, man, I'm starting to feel bad for the canvas as he lands another takedown there. He landed another takedown, and he's doing it over and over again. What I am a massive fan of is his cardio, the ability to be able to keep this pace over and over as he hits his takedown attempt. Oh, nice right hand from Khabib Nurmagomedov. DC, we talk so much about the wrestling and the grappling, you can't sleep on Nurmagomedov's boxing. Great punch from the clinch here. Now some spacing as they exit the clinch. Good body position, yup. Khabib's in half guard. Now he's going full mount. All right, so he continues to land, and not exactly what we thought we would see in this one tonight, but the wrestler willing to stand and trade and proving to be able as well. Yeah, it's out of the ordinary. Usually this guy level changes to take it on very early in fights, but tonight he is showing that he is comfortable in the striking, and he is... He's got that arm triangle. Watch him pass to the opposite side. It looks real tight. He'll drop his weight to try to finish his technique. And he needs you to defend your neck. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what this guy brought to the octagon and his show in that defense. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Nice punch lands over the top. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found double leg takedown attempt here, and that is a good attempt as he gets the fight back to the mat. It's ideal. His ideal situation just happened. He got his shot, didn't have to put too much effort to finish. Great job. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. There it is. Now he's going to mount. All right, so he's got the ground and pound game going here. And he is back up to his feet. Just over two minutes to go. Leg kick lands. All right, so now his body language really starting to change and the bruises starting to accumulate on that side. I mean, you're looking at it, right? When you can visibly see the damage on the body, you know that the work has been done. What a beautiful game plan put together by this team. 
Good series of punches by him there. He has been busy throughout. He's doing a great job with the hands. He looks like a professional boxer out there. This beautiful kick lands. Big shot lands for both guys. Oh, he's doing a really good job of levitating off of the strikes, too. He passes to half guard. Getting the moan here. He's got to be careful here. Great job finding his shots from the top position. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pounds. Oh, he's got a lot of different arm bars he can go to attacking here. Looks pretty tight this year. It's getting tight right now, John. No, he's out. The fight's going to continue. Oh, my goodness. I thought it was over. I thought this fight was over. And he's back up. 45 seconds remaining in the round. That was a solid punch. Watch out for the setup here, DC. I know you don't pay your bets, but I'll bet you 100 bucks he goes for another takedown here. <laughs> if I don't pay, then why are you betting me? I'll yell in the octagon and go, man, don't shoot so that I can get paid. <laughs> but if I'm betting, I'm trying to take you over. I know that he's going to get another takedown, so I will try to force you into saying that he does do it again or something. We'll I don't see. know. We'll see. I'm not the gambling guy. You're the gambling guy. You can push me up with your words. And there it is yet again going for the takedown. Body kick there. Oh. Ten minutes oh. in the books. Oh. All right, so there's the end of the round. A lot of high level action. And if you like the takedown game, as my boy Daniel Cormier does. You enjoyed that round. It's like we're watching the NCAA wrestling tournament. It's takedown after takedown. He's fighting his fight. He's able to change levels, drive into his opponent, and secure takedown after takedown. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they barely broke in a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fight. He's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Nermago Menov's going for the sub here. Oh, he's got it locked in tight now. Great job maintaining position there. You never want to lose position to chase a submission. Grounded him and pounded him. Nice job. Going to try to take his opponents back here, and he does. Well, as many expected, his grappling has been very strong thus far. The takedowns, the ground control, he is truly the total pack. It's one thing to take your opponent down. It's one thing to control him, as we have seen him do over the course of this fight. Nurmagomedov gets caught by that straight punch. You got to do better than that defensively. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. Way to sneak that elbow around the side of the guard. So new round, same narrative as he takes him down again. He does a fantastic job finding the takedown the tip, not wasting the energy. A lot of times people believe if the takedown's not easy, don't waste the energy. This guy got it done very easily. And he's back up again. So the takedowns have been there, as have the get-ups. Right on the button. Three minutes to go in round three. Nice work here on the clinch by Nermago Meta. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. Well, you got to think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a strike. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much 
to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the match? All right, feet on the hips here. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Great job finding an opening and landing a beautiful punch from the punch. Agobeto gets the double leg takedown. How good was that? All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. He's a big shot, and they're not glancing blows. When he's throwing, he is landing so clean that his head is starting off the mat. Oh, looked like that strike from the bottom fighter got the crowd's attention. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. In the half guard. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds. Making up for lost time here. Pressure being applied here. Oh, it looks like he's got him in a crucifix now. Look at him attack that arm triangle on the opposite side. When it's time to finish, he will lock his hands, pass his body all the way to the opposite side, drop his chest to get all the way down to his opponent's end. And there he did it! The winner by submission. Holy. Wow, an unbelievable result here tonight by way of submission. And he bided his time there. He stayed patient, waited for an opening, and then when it was there, he certainly capitalized to get the tap here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. He's so skilled, he's so tricky, and he's so good at weaving a web that gets you lost in it that he made him pay for it tonight and got the submission victory. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 48 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by submission, getting an arm triangle choke, and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle. All right, so a lot of fighters have suffered from a similar fate against Khabib Nurmagomedov. You heard it there from Buff. He gets it done by submission tonight. I mean, this is his world. When you're having to 